it's the fighter's art. I don't know if I ever asked you about that when I did some, but I asked other fighters. They, a lot of them describe as you start off, your whole life is trying to get the UFC. First thing you get the UFC, you're just happy to be there. You think, yeah. if I win and look good, they will reward me. Well, I mean, you're so, also broke. Yeah. You're also dead broke. Yeah. When I got signed for three and three, I was freaking rich. Well, that, that's why I talk about that, that one area where the UFC is beats boxing. It's the undercard. You come to the UFC, you're going to make a lot more than you did before. You're going to be very happy. I mean, I had I had like 15 fights already at that time, point in time. I bet you when you got to the UFC, you were fairly happy because you were making a lot more suddenly in the UFC than you had in the regional scene, right? Yes. Yeah. So that's a positive, but then the problem starts because you're happy to be there. You're happy mm -hmm. that you're making so you don't complain. Mm -hmm. You think, if I just do good, I'll be rewarded. And so you keep head well, down, you, keep fighting. You have fighting. no idea how much money they're making off your oh, yeah. shoulders either. Yeah.